<laughs> okay. <laughs> Madam General Evaluator, fellow Toastmasters, most welcome guests, and especially Larry. Larry was speaking out of the advanced manual, humorously speaking. It's an advanced speech number one. Warm up your audience. The title of his speech, The Power of Negative Thinking. Well, I got something negative for you, Larry. <laughs> you were not yourself today. <laughs> I noticed the improvement right away. <laughs> second, second thing I gotta tell you is don't believe everything you think. <laughs> Larry started, the reason why I say this is because these are one-liners, and Larry started with a one-liner. What he did, he crafted a story around the one-liner, which is this gentleman that shows up to a bookstore and says to someone, where is the self-help section? And they say, the reply is, it would defeat the purpose if I told you. <laughs> and he crafted the story, made it interesting, ended up with it. That was the punchline. Very well done. We have to borrow when we want to use humor. We have to borrow from what's available and make it our own. You did that very well. Created curiosity. We wanted to know what's next. The power of negative thinking. Very original. Because most of us would not go there. We'd go into, let's be positive. <laughs> the things that we hear all day long. No. He reversed the story. There's a yin-yang in everything in the world. Positive, negative. Love, hatred. There is a yin-yang everywhere. And he used it very well. Kept us wanting to know what's next. We were captivated, curious. Did the story attract and keep our attention? Absolutely, because there's an element of surprise. Where is he getting? Where is he going with this? It was well done. Again, Larry, you started behind the lectern and you waited behind the lectern until you wanted to have more impact. We walked in front of the lectern only when we want to impact our gestures and words and look into someone's eyes. Otherwise, stay behind the lectern. He knew his story. He was not reading. But every word, every pause he took, he didn't take a pause because he was thinking about what's the next line. He took a pause to create impact. Well rehearsed. And the only thing that I can tell you is to improve your speeches. Get out of this club! <laughs> 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 <laughs>